Come on. Who's here? Oh. Today we're in Upland, California, a fierce national dance competition. We're going to see the traders. And I would love to see Camille and actually tell her what I think about her. I heard that she called Brent a liar in the middle of a bar. I saw a post on Instagram of Cameron dancing at the ALDC. Brynn's been lying about a whole bunch of Brynn has been there you go. such Brynn. a good kid. Brynn's a liar. Dumbass Camille posted pictures of Cameron at the ALDC. So I'm not quite sure how that makes Brynn a liar when there's actual physical proof that she was there. Ashley, we missed you yesterday. Well, I really don't need to go hang out with pieces of like that. Wait, wait. Did you just call me a piece of Wait a minute. You lying, bitch. Wait a minute. Excuse you me, come on. Jeez, can't watch your mouth for five Here seconds. You better kiss my ass. That's not probably. Holly, what's inappropriate is her standing in a public place screaming that my kid is an effing liar. You call my kid a liar as well. Just go. I don't care. You're a liar. I'm so tired of Let's go. You're out of control. Let's go to our dressing room. Oh, Sorry. Because now oh, we should not do this in front oh, of them. Hi. Ashley is a big bully coward. She's trying to validate her decision to dance with the minis. Picking on Cameron and Camille isn't going to do it, Ashley. You screwed up. That's what I mean about Ashley. She'll take elements of truth and then she'll manipulate it. Because you can't it. deny it, because it's and true. You know, alternative facts. She is a big proponent of that. And then Stacy was like, I can't be around this. And then trying to guard her daughter's ears. I'm like, really? And Ashley is talking like that. I'm sure she's heard much worse. Going into this week, there's a lot at stake. I think our girls feel like they have to prove not only to themselves or to the world, but to Abby, to Ashley. Like, we don't need Abby to win. We can be successful standing on our own. Enough of this nonsense. We need to focus on the girls and the group dance and put this behind us. We just need to get them out of our head and focus on our kids and their dance. I'm going to steal a line from Dr. Holly right this minute. When they go low, we go high. End of story. You did not raise your voice. You were very calm. And you just said, look, classy. I am protecting my child. Well, except when I looked at her and called her a piece of oh. That's not very classy, but at least I got my point across. You were clear. That's, true. That's her. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Abby. Hi. Hello. Do you have any plans on saying anything to those other mothers today? You have nothing to say to them. I, I've made them so much money. I don't even want to think about it. Are you worried? Uh, I'm worried about leotards going up butts. Abby's behavior is so weird. We're going up against the teams that left the team, and Abby is doing her best to try to not let on how she feels about it, but I think she's sad, honestly. I just hope that she can just stay focused because we really have to beat the older kids and prove that we can do it without them. I'm sure that there's going to be some nasty little comments in the audience about why our kids aren't dancing solos. I don't understand why their lives are so boring that they are so obsessed with what we do.